in the closet. Yeah, she was in the closet for almost 12 hours. How did that feel? Invigorating. It felt good. I asked him, what, did, what, what do you think she felt? Do you think she was scared of you? And he says, well, no, I don't really think so. And, you know, my sense is she must have been very frightened. Uh, he doesn't seem to have understood that. So what I'm getting is that his, his sense of empathy was impaired. One of the people I, I, beat, on, I beat on really well, and I don't know whether or not he was taken to the hospital. Uh, I didn't care. It wasn't my problem. I won that fight. No room for surprise. That money boy is down road.
your own thought, you know? If you lack capacity for emotions like this, you're really left with one dimension to relate to other people, which is status relationships. The inconsistency between the affect that he displays during the interview and what he's talking about. He tries deliberately to keep a fixed facial expression. Yet, he's talking about an incredible range of subjects in terms of emotional content. Yet his facial expression changes little, if at all. And if you turn down the volume, you would find it difficult or almost impossible to tell what he was talking about at any given point.